Hello students. The next topic is subset of a fuzzy set. Let A and B be any two fuzzy sets defined on an universal set X. Then A is said to be a subset of B if the membership grade of X is lesser than or equal to the membership grade of X in B. So the membership grade of X in A is lesser than or equal to the membership grade of X in B for all X element of capital X. And this is denoted by A subset of B. If the membership grade of X in A is strictly lesser than the membership grade of X in B for all X element of capital X, then A is said to be a proper subset of B. And it is denoted by A subset of B. That is proper subset of B. So whenever the membership grade of all the elements of the fuzzy set A is lesser than or equal to the membership grades of those elements in the fuzzy set B, then the fuzzy set A is said to be a subset of B and it is denoted by A subset of B. If it is strictly lesser than, that is A of X is strictly lesser than B of X, then it is strictly a sub proper subset of B. So, A is a proper subset of B. Let us see this with the help of an example. So, now here we have a universal set A, B, C, D and E. And the corresponding fuzzy sets A and B. So, where we have the membership values for each element of X in A and B. So, the element A takes the membership value 0 0.2 in the fuzzy set A. And the element B takes the membership value 0 0.4 in the fuzzy set A. And C takes 1, the element D takes 0 0.6 and the element E takes 0 0.1. And here we have a set B where the membership grade of the element A is 0 0.3 in the fuzzy set B. And the membership grade of B, the element B is 0 0.5 in the fuzzy set B and for the element C 0 0.9 D is 0 0.5 and E is 0 0.1 so this is arbitrarily chosen fuzzy sets so we have considered these two for an example so now let us see well, is is A a subset of B or B a subset of A so let us check that now so how do we have to check we have to check for the member grade membership grades of each element in the set A and the set B we have to compare them so when comparing we see that the membership grade of the element A in the fuzzy set A is equal to 0 0.2 and the membership grade of the element A in the fuzzy set B is 0 0.3 so when we compare these two, we observe that the membership grade of A in the fuzzy set A is lesser than the membership grade of the element A in the fuzzy set B. So this is lesser. Now similarly we shall com uh, compare for the element B. So now for the element B if we check out again the membership grade of B in A is lesser than the membership grade of B in the fuzzy set B. So if we see this is 0 0.5 and this is 0 0.4, we know that 0 0.4 is lesser than 0 0.5. So like this we have to check for every element. Now for the element C, here the membership grade is 1. And here the membership grade of C in B is 0 0.9. So we observe that the membership grade of C in A is greater than the membership grade of B, I mean the membership grade of C in B. So if we see here we have lesser and here we have greater. So we observe that neither A is a subset of B nor B is a subset of A. So now these two sets are not subsets of each other. Likewise, we will consider another example. So if we check in this new example that we have considered, now let us compare the membership grades. Here if you see the membership grade of A in B, 
it is 0 0.3 and this is the membership grade of the element A in capital A. It is 0 0.2. So we observe that the membership this is greater than this. So similarly 0 0.5 is greater than 0 0.4. 1 is greater than 0 0.9. 0 0.6 is greater than 0 0.5. And 0 0.1 is equal to 0 0.1. So it can be either greater or equal. So if we observe that all the membership grades of the fuzzy set B is greater than the all the membership grades of those elements in the fuzzy set A. So therefore we observe that the membership grade of any element X taken in the fuzzy set A if is all is lesser than or equal to because we have an equal to case here. So it is either lesser than or equal to the membership grades of any element taken in the fuzzy set B. So like for example here for all X element of capital X. So this implies that A is a subset of B. So the fuzzy set A is a subset of fuzzy set B. So, hope you have understood the concept of subset of a fuzzy set. I will just explain this with the help of a graph too. So, now here we consider a graph where along the x-axis I have chosen the elements of capital X. That is A, B, C, D, E. And here I have given the membership grades. Now, if we observe in the fuzzy set A, A has the membership grade 0 0.2. So, here we have a... 0 0.2 and the fuzzy and in the fuzzy set a the membership grade of the element b is 0 0.4 so i'm just plotting it here so this is uh, not exactly geometrical but uh, for your kind understanding i have just shown it uh, in free hand okay so now for the element c we have 0 0.9 so we can choose it here maybe uh, so if you observe yeah, it is here 0 0.9 for the element C and for the element D we have 0 0.5 so here it is and for the element E it is 0 0.1 so here it is so when we join this we get the fuzzy set A so this is how we have to draw the fuzzy graph uh, for the for the fuzzy set A this is the graph so along x-axis I have chosen the elements un of the universal set and along the y-axis I have chosen the membership grades between 0 0.1 that is between 0 so this is 0 and 1 so this is the uh, highest membership grade 1. Then now let us draw the fuzzy set B. So now if you see the membership grade of A is 0 0.3 so it will be somewhere here and the membership grade of B is 0 0.5 so somewhere here. And the membership grade of C is 1, so here. And the membership grade of D is 0 0.6, so it must be here. And then uh, for uh, the element E, it is 0 0.1 again, so it has to be here only. So I'm just uh, drawing it above it. Okay, so now if you see, we have to join these plotted points to get the fuzzy set B. And we observe that the fuzzy set A is a subset of the fuzzy set B. So this is how we have to draw a fuzzy graph. And this is the sub subset. Uh, the, the set A is a subset of uh, fuzzy set B. So this is the graph for the fuzzy set B. And this is the graph for the fuzzy set A. So A is a subset of b so we have inferred that a is a subset of b hope you have understood the concept of subset of a fuzzy set you may draw it in a graph sheet so that you get the exact plotted points so this i have done with free hand so you try to do it in a graph sheet in our next video we shall learn about the operations on fuzzy sets we will be learning about the basic operations like complement of a fuzzy set union of two fuzzy sets and then intersection of two fuzzy sets thank you